Okay. Hello everyone, it is me, Curly DIY, and today I'm going to do a review on Kinky Curly Not Today, the Natural Leave-In and Detangler, which is what I am wearing my hair right now. I went to school today, I'm so hot, because California is really, either really, really hot or like really, really cold, so I took a shower right when I got home because it was just so hot and muggy, I was like, that was a weird face, I'm sorry. So, um, Kinky Curly, I've used it for about five days, about a week, about a week. And I love it. It really does take out your tangles, which is pretty cool. I mean, it's awesome. And it smells really good, but if you guys don't, wouldn't like this, if you guys buy it and you don't end up liking the smell, don't worry because the smell goes away. Goes away. Like, it doesn't stay in your hair. Mm. Smells like a pina colada. And I love pina colada. Virgin, of course. But I love pina coladas. And it does make my hair soft. And I like it because it forms my curls. Because my hair is very really thin and my hair is curly. And I, like, sometimes the condition. Ah, ooh, that was just weird. Ooh, I have a fear like when my nails are long or something and when it's when it, when it goes against something I feel like my nails are gonna fall off like if it goes size if it goes against something the wrong way ooh, I just feel like it's gonna fall off and it's just oh, it's a terrible feeling for me anyways this is all natural which is another great thing for about kinky curly and kinky curly has been around for years like I didn't even know how long it was around because I was at Whole Foods don't get it at Whole Foods. Just, just let me get it to you. Don't get it at Whole Foods. It's it's, four, it's like fifteen dollars there when you could get at Target for like eleven, so eleven ninety nine. So about twelve bucks for this. Um, I didn't even know it was around for that long. Like I showed my mom the bottle. She's like, Oh my god, it's awesome. It's been around for so long. And I was like, Oh really? That's that's cool. So the thing I like about this, it does give very specific directions for like the type of hair you have so like apply generously and walk through troubled section with a white tooth comb i just apply it all throughout my hair i use it as a leave-in detangle i don't apply any extra product because even if i apply like three products or even like more than that it's just i get so much build up and it's really bad for my scalp because my scalp it's very sensitive so yeah so, kinky curly, it just forms my curls and everything, and I even apply it the next day, like, to handle my next day curls. So, yeah, I really do like this, um, but, like, like for thick, coarse curls, you apply a generous amount as a leave-in and completely detangle hair before applying a, a kinky curly styling product. I don't have the custard because I'm not a gel fan at all, like, at all. I mean, sometimes I use mousse, but usually I just, I'm good with it. And then, for like, for me, like, loose wavy curls, like, when my hair is, because my hair is thin, um, use a moderate amount as they rinse out or leave in, or leave a little on the ends before applying Kiki Curly Styling Products. I apply it as a leave-in detangler and I just put, like, a quarter size amount, and then I just go like this and rub it throughout my hair. And my hair is, like, well, I wrap a, either a shirt or a towel around my hair when I, apply my lotion my body lotion on, and then I take my hair off and apply this so my hair is like damp like it's not dripping wet but it's wet wet enough for me to apply this on and everything so I apply on and I just I make sure it gets all through with my wide tooth comb well it was my mom's and then I was looking for it I couldn't find it so I found it yesterday which is good the wider the tooth the easier it is the easier it is to detangle but I think this one's great for me because that way I just like it because I know that I'm actually getting tangles out with this comb so pretty wide tooth comb and um, the ingredients are organic mango fruit extract organic slippery elm organic marshmallow root organic lemongrass cedar alcohol and stuff I cannot pronounce except for natural fragrance and citric acid. So everything's pretty much natural in here. Um, if you don't like citric acid, then well, it's not one of the first five ingredients. Wait. No, it's not. So I'm I doubt that there isn't a lot of citric acid in here. But if you like really really don't like it, then you probably should not get this. 
but I've used a pretty decent amount. Hold on. Guys, like, I've used a pretty decent amount. I don't use a lot because once I get my hair done, I will show you guys the texture right now. Hold on. I don't want to scoop it with my fingers. Hold on. It's, it's, the bottle's very squeezable, so it's kind of hard for me to tell what amount I'm squeezing out. So. And I got out a very small amount. This is the amount I use for when I'm applying, like, like second date curls. Like, this is the amount I use. And let me show you how. It really isn't thick. It's actually really, really light. There's also a Shea Moisture Detangler that's exactly like Kinky Curly. And actually, Shea Moisture, I hear it goes on sale at Target. But Kinky Curly has never. Um, so, if you want... And Shea Moisture is thicker. So if you want a thicker leave-in conditioner, just get Shea Moisture. It, it will do the exact same thing, but the only thing is it smells different. So it's 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 nice, and it's a clear kind of. I like rubbed all over my hand, and sorry for my disgusting nails. And yeah, so it's nice. I applied some on my hair. Okay, so bye all. It's a great product. You should go and buy it because it's nice for my hair. It's probably good for your hair. And, like, I do research before I buy any products. And, like, when I told my grandpa this, I'm like, I found research on YouTube. He's like, you found research on YouTube? I'm like, yes, I did. And, yeah. my It's hot today, so I'm going to put my hair in a bun. But, so, Kinky Curly, you could get it for about 12 dollars eleven ninety nine to be exact so about twelve dollars at target other unless you really don't care that you're spending like three bucks extra then go ahead buy it at whole foods but just saying if you want to save some money get it at target and it's great it's great 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 and um the texture is great it smells great but if you don't like the smell it'll go away it well because i have a very strong scented shampoo and conditioner so is it just the smell from this goes away right away and a little goes a long way i thought well actually a dime to a quarter size is what i apply and today i thought i applied too much but it was pretty much good so i think i'm gonna keep applying quarter sizes because it makes my hair defined because last time i applied too little and it didn't keep my curls defined i was like no i really wanted this to work so yeah do you guys like my crystal Ooh. Okay, so that's pretty much it for today. Um, in, I'm not sure, but in the beginning of the video, I did film, I did take a photo of me with my curly wet hair. And it was like in the middle, it was like right in the middle before drying. And so it's this on, so yeah. I'll be, I'll put some, I may, I might put some pictures at the end of this video of me just having mustache combs. So. I'm weird. Okay, I'm just gonna stop the video. Okay, bye guys. I love you so much. Make sure you go on my Instagram. It is it's private because you know I'm still like I'm 13, so I want to I still want to be safe. So like um, but my Instagram is curly no no capital curly um, underscore and then DIY no capital and yeah you're finding me. It's a photo of me sorry I'm like. So, yeah, no bun, though. Okay, I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you again, and I hope you go out to get this product because it is worth your money. And it melts out tangles, by the way. Okay, love you guys. Bye.